just want to tell you a little bit about myself um, real quickly. Um, this is really who I am. Sometimes you see me in a suit. I'm not really a suit, okay? Um, I really uh, love teaching martial arts. Uh, that, if anyone asked me, you know, when I was running my schools back in the day, a couple years ago, uh, what was my biggest success? Why was I, you know, have so many students? It had nothing to do with marketing or anything. It was teaching. So teaching to me, you know, that's the thing that I, I talk to thousands of martial arts schools, um, you know, trying to help them as much as I can. And one of the, the biggest things I can give you is your classes at the end of the day will determine, you know, how much your school grows. Everything else will help you, but your, your teaching, your methods uh, of teaching, your excitement, your energy, those are things that are key. Uh, I just had a baby uh, goddaughter. I'm really excited about that. Her name's Meadow. That's her in the top right-hand corner. It's one of my clients down there, Rich Grogan, at the, at the Seaway Unite. We're like, we look like actually brothers. It's kind of funny, so I had to put that picture in there. I just got a new dog down there. Her name is um, Nina. She's a uh, Chorky, half ch a Chihuahua, half Yorkie. Uh, if you see me, I'm always wearing Adidas. Most of the time, thick laces, red Adidas as well. That's one of my special students down there who had cancer and beat it. Um, so just want to tell you a little bit about myself before we get started. So about Champions Way, we are now up to 83 employees. Uh, we're obviously rapidly growing. Uh, some amazing people that we're working with. You see them there at the desks, uh, top right-hand corner. Those people were very, very uh, big uh, parts of Mr. Marketer. Again, thanks to Pedro and Eric and everybody part of uh, building Mr. Marketer. Uh, one of the greatest things about working with Champions Way is our CEO and our management team. Uh, not only you know, are most of us martial artists, but we also care about the community. Uh, Vahid uh, and Nima were responsible and Master Freed for sponsoring children that uh, can't, don't have any food, and I'm sure you heard Master Free talk about this before. He's our CEO. Uh, that's one of the things that I wanted to highlight as well. So today's webinar topic is the current number, is the current number of enrolled students this month stressing you out? Um, and I can tell you from what I hear from a lot of different school owners, you know, uh, anywhere from September to December, uh, the months are always different. You know, some of the months were good, some of the months you were satisfied with, some of the months you're scared. Uh, some, of the, you know, some of the months are down, some of the months are up. Some people do great with certain things, some people do nothing with certain things. But if you find yourself in this situation where you're finding yourself stressed out over enrollments, uh, we're going to help you out a lot today with that. And the takeaways today are very simple. Uh, the first thing is stress does not happen overnight. Stress can't be cured overnight. Where do I start? And then we're going to talk about Mr. Marketer, which is mostly why everybody is here today, to learn more about Mr. Marketer, what it is, and how it can help your school. So takeaway number one where I talk about stress does not happen overnight. You find yourself stressed. You find yourself broke. Uh, financially, you're struggling. There's nothing worse than fi struggling financially. Um, yes, I know what it's like to struggle financially. I've struggled financially when I opened my school. I, I've been in that situation where me and my wife, uh, I was home one weekend, and I did not know where my next meal was coming from. That's a true story. Uh, we sat there and, you know, we just couldn't even go out. It was embarrassing, you know, and I just decided at that point that I was never going to be in that situation again. It was one of the worst feelings I ever had, and I just, I really had to just make sure that my mindset was clear, and I, I just stopped thinking about it. I know it's hard to say that, but if you keep thinking about your financial uh, situation uh, all the time, you know, then you're going to take it out on a lot of other people. You're going to take it out on your staff. Your, your, your students are going to feel it. So as, as easy as it's to say, but it's hard to do. But that's one thing that uh, we, we're going to work on a little bit today. So when you find yourself in this situation, in my opinion, it's, it's really important to get back to the drawing board, getting back to the basics. So if you are in a situation where you're, you're stressed out about students, you're not sure about your income, things like that, these are the things I believe from talking to so many different school owners of why you're in this situation. And the first thing is you're working from home, okay? Okay. Um, this will be the downfall of your business. It doesn't work. It just doesn't work. You cannot work from home. You need to live in your school until you actually have someone else that could do it, have a team, uh, and even when you have that, you have to check in. So working from home will absolutely destroy your, your martial arts school. You might think that you're going on Facebook. It's not the same. You need to be in there. You need to make sure you know, that everything's clean. You need to make sure that people are getting called. You should be on the phone. If you have 40 students, you should be on the phone every single Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday making sure that those 40 students are coming in. All right, there's a general rule that uh, actually one of my mentors explained to me years ago. Uh, as soon as somebody misses one week of class, there's only a 25% chance they're coming back. Two weeks of classes, it's down to 50. Three weeks, it's down to 75. Once they're gone for a month, there's no chance of them coming back. You know the numbers are slim to none. 
So the most successful school owners I know are obsessed with their students, making sure they're, they're okay, sending them up for makeup lessons, on the phone, good job notes, everything. Uh, the second thing that I noticed, uh, and that's a shout-out to Mark Russo, who gave me that uh, statistic years ago. I don't know if Sensei Mark's here. If you are a Sensei, uh, thank you for that one. Um, the second thing I've noticed is, you know, you start pointing the finger at everybody else. Uh, your website's not working. The software doesn't work. Uh, you know, your instructors aren't doing their job. It, it just becomes like a, a pointing the finger at everybody else. And the most important thing in becoming successful is, you know, when you're struggling is taking accountability for your actions because you're the reason why you're failing. It's no one else's fault. Uh, one of the other things would be you open your school at 3 o'clock. Just if you want to be open at 3 o'clock, then you, you should have a, another full-time job. Have another full-time. If you have a full-time job and you're opening at 3, that's a different story. But if you don't have another full-time job and you're coming in at 3, uh, I would say you're probably roughly around 60 to 90 students prob approximately. Um, and you'll be there forever. Uh, you are not open on Friday for, for personal time with your family. This is a really tough situation or a really tough uh, one to talk about here, but people always talk about, you know, family comes first, you know, and I agree with that. And unfortunately, in today's society, you know, you can't really take care of your family without money. You just can't. I mean, if you want to, you, eventually you need to eat something. You need to go to the store. You need to do something. Unless you're going to sit in the box and do nothing, then you'll be okay. So as much as you want to have personal time with your family, you're going to have to explain to your family that, you know, your business is what feeds them. Your business is what is so critical. And at such an important time, especially nowadays with the economy and so much, so many people are scared. Consumers aren't spending the money like they used to back in 2005. Um, that's something you're really going to have to talk about with your spouse if you're getting issues with that. You have kids to run your school, kids teaching classes. A kid cannot teach leadership. I'm sorry, but they can't. I don't care how long they've been training with you. Uh, but, you know, me, if you bring me in my, if I was in your school and there was a 16-year-old talking about leadership qualities, um, I would say to the head instructor, listen, I really appreciate that. Uh, and he's great as a SWAT member, but I'm sorry, your, your son or this kid or whoever it is who's teaching these classes on leadership, I, I just, I really would prefer to have you out there. That's what I would say. You know, so having kids talking about leadership, character development, life skills, and yeah, they could talk and regurgitate the information you train them on. But a real amazing instructor could talk about books that they've read, how they've struggled, and kids just can't do that. They can't talk about that. So kids running your school uh, will kill you. Um, and then if the other part of the situation while you're finding yourself in a situation if you're stressed out is your classes stink. Uh, I'm using nice words, okay? Um, and we'll get back to, to making sure you have great classes in a little bit. So, okay, so what if I'm wrong about all of them, all those things I just mentioned, Okay. So what if those are not the problems? Then here are the problems. When you're teaching, you're not educating. Uh, your job is to educate. Not only martial arts, life skills, leadership, all, all those different things. If you're not reading and educating yourself, then your students are going to be bored as well. So you're not educating people on the benefits, okay, and you're trying to sell. You're worried about the most common question I get all the time is, I need more leads, I need more leads, I need more leads. And that is why I'm talking about all this stuff because that's what brought us to Mr. Marketer. People just thinking not outside the box, thinking about the wrong things, any more leads, any more leads, any more leads. No. What you need to do is focus more on your students. The students are the golden ticket to your martial arts school. If, you if your students are happy, you get referrals. If you're worried about leads, you're not getting referrals. If you're teaching amazing classes, you get, le you get leads, you get uh, referrals. So not, you know, if you're selling all the time, or you're, or you're trying to do a bully prevention seminar or community events to get members, that's okay. But at the end of the day, you should be helping others. That's, that's what you have to do. Uh, the other problem will be you're not solving a pain. So if you're teaching classes and you think they're great, but it's not solving a child's issues with focus, concentration, life skills, getting bullied, picked on, coordination, those types of things, and you're just talking about how you're a champion point fighter or you're a jiu-jitsu champion uh, and what you did and how great you are, no one cares. I mean, it's just, it's just the truth. The people that do care... Uh, they're going to train with someone specifically uh, for those for those types of things. But the majority of our C students that make the majority of our martial arts school up, the average student, the average child, the average student, they don't care about you know what you've done. So if you're not solving pains, then it's not going to really help you see yourself grow. Your students are satisfied but are not loyal. Uh, one of the one of the books I recommend to everybody that's in the business is um, "Customer Satisfaction Is Worthless, Customer Loyalty Is Priceless" by Jeffrey Gittimer. And it talks all about customer loyalty. And, you know, if, you're, if, if people are satisfied when your name comes up in conversation, it's something like this. 
Yeah, uh, you know, Sensei Bill. Yeah, it's, uh, I, you know, I go there. It's pretty good. You know, that, that's what that's the conversation. When your people are loyal to you, they say, "Wait a second, wait a second, guys." Before we start our poker tournament, I just got to tell you one thing. You guys know how bad you know little Nicky was, right? Like you know, his, he had no focus, no concentration. He's been going to champions for six months. You have to bring your child there. Whoever your daughter, sister, whatever sports they're playing, they got to get there. They have to come. When do you guys want to come? Could you guys come next week with me? That's a loyal customer, someone that goes out of their way. That's how I started with Champions Way. I was a loyal customer. I believed in them. I, I loved them, and I told everybody to get them. And I know how much they care about the customers. Uh, here's another issue that some people make. Uh, basically is, sorry, Vahid, if you could tell everybody to stop calling me from uh, Vancouver, that would be great. Um, you are open in a terrible area. So when you, you know, if you find yourself in a situation, you're in this area where no one could find you, uh, that could be another issue. And then one of the eight other biggest issues I've noticed are you're underfinanced. Like you opened a school with no money. And if you read The Art of War, I mean, you need to be financed when you go to war. And that's what business is. You're, every day you're going to war. It's a jungle. Everybody's trying to take a piece of what you have. Every little school, they're always trying to get their students. Every, it's every day. So if you open a school under finance, then you're, there's nothing you could do about it now. Like you're in that situation. Um, so what you're, either you're going to have to get more students, you're going to have to get another job, do private lessons. You do what you've got to do. That's what you have to do at this point. So take away number two, stress can't be curved overnight or cured overnight. Stop asking the wrong questions. Okay, and these are the wrong questions. How can I get more leads? How can I make more money? Will it get me more students today? And the reason why those are the wrong questions is because when you're asking those questions, you're not thinking about how you're helping people. It's all about you. At the end of the day in any business, if you think about how you're going to help other people, then you actually get rewarded. So think outside the box. How can I more leads? How can I more money? If that's all you're consumed about every single day and you're not worried about how you can help other people, then your mindset's going to be off. You're going to be stressed out beyond belief. The right question is, what is the root cause of why my school is in this situation? That's the right question. So what is the root cause of why is my school in this situation? I mentioned a whole bunch of them. I'm not sure for everybody. Everyone might have a different reason. Uh, but get to that root cause. Find out what happened. Find out you know, what it is and move on from there. So I have a picture here of a foundation. And in my opinion, um, the, the, the foundation of running a business, not only a martial arts school, any business, has changed drastically. And I want to go over three main things of, you know, why and, and what you need to do. So the foundation of the business, you know, used to be, you know, teach great classes and, you know, that's, that was all great and everything would work out. Well, now everything's changed and there's some things that we need to be aware of so we, we know uh, we're not finding ourselves in this situation next year. So have you adapted to the following things? Uh, the three main things that have changed, number one is inflation. Number two is distracted staff. Number three is consumers. So let's talk about them individually real quick, and then we're going to be going into some solutions on how we can make this better. If you don't raise your prices, you will lose money each year. Okay, everything that is like if you don't track your expenses, your belts are going up. Okay, the cost of instructors are going up. You have Obamacare now; you have to pay it for full-time instructors for health insurance. All these things are coming up around you. So if you've been charging one nineteen a month, and you, you for the past six years, and you keep charging that. It's not that you're making less money. It's that all your expenses are going up. So you, now you start stressing out because you, then not, you just have to raise your prices. And if you find yourself in a situation where you don't feel comfortable doing that, you know, I'd be more than happy to talk to you about just three things that I think you need to do before you raise your prices. Uh, it's very detailed, but I can't go over it right now. But there's three main things. If you are going to raise your prices, you should be doing three main things. Um, so send me an email. I can talk to you more about that if you find yourself in a situation where you've been charging the same amount of money for 10 years. Point blank, uh, it's harder to get customers. Your strategy is stale. Okay, the Clipper magazine, we know it doesn't work as much as it used to. Um, you know, people are sh price shopping. You spend money on Google AdWords and uh, other things, and people are coming, and they're, they're finding out more about your school. There's more, more options. So, you know, we have to be creative uh, with, with, with getting people through the door. You know, not only, you know, just an email, but getting them into the door, into the mat. So it is harder to get customers. It is harder, without a doubt. And your strategy is more than likely needs to be adapted as well. Uh, for employees, pay on performance and establish what I call them rules of distraction. 
Um, you know, it's, it's, this is a very distracted world you live in, and this is a great picture. I wish he was at a desk, but you notice he's got the headpiece on, he's drinking coffee, and he's, got, he's looking on his cell phone and he's driving at the same time. Well, in your situation, it's like you have someone that's actually supposed to be teaching, and they're going in the changing room or they have their cell phone by the mat and they're checking their Facebook statuses. Like, the, the studies have shown that every time that you go on Facebook, it takes you 20 minutes to get back to the focus level of where you were before you were on there. So every time that, you know, they're talking to a customer and they check Facebook, it's just a total distraction. And pay on performance is something that will benefit you, the school, and the instructor. And it, 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 it basically it's a, it's a system where, you know, if it's your introductory lesson, if you're an intro, your program director, head instructor, whatever it is, everyone should be paid on performance, uh, you know, on how well they perform, what they bring in. I've, I've even told that to my staff here. I said, you know, if, if I have to do everything and talk to the customers, uh, you know, make the marketing collateral and, not, and bring in all the customers, do the webinar, well, what am, then why do I need a staff? I mean, really, it would make more sense for me financially to get rid of everybody and have 50 clients. I mean, that's, that's, you know, you're in the same situation. So pay on performance, and I can give you some more information about that later. So takeaway number three, which is where do I start? And the most important thing is getting organized because you're all over the place. You're not sure where you, what you need to do. Where do you start? So here's are the five steps I'd like you to take uh, in order to get started with basically you know, not being stressed in the future. The first step is uh, looking at the numbers. Okay, so looking at the numbers can hurt, but not knowing them could be the end. If you don't know your numbers, and when I'm not just talking about the dashboard here. Okay, I'm talking about expenses. What are all of your expenses? Okay. Uh, one thing I talk to so many school owners about is when you have these other programs, whether it's, it doesn't matter what kind of other program it is, but do you know like what actually if the profit is actually, I'm sorry, the program is actually making a profit? Let's just say you, you have a uh, kickboxing, fitness kickboxing class. You know, you offer 10 classes a week. You're paying your instructors $1,000 a month. You know, and at the end of the day, are you even making a profit? You need to do that for every single program. Uh, one of the greatest books I've ever read, uh, Profits Aren't Everything, They're the Only Thing. And one of the quotes in there is, is, is it doesn't make dollars, it doesn't make sense. So, you know, unfortunately, if you, you, know, you could be wasting your time on programs that make you absolutely no money. So finding out your expenses, finding out the total cost of all these different programs, do you really need them? Are they making you money? Are your instructors costing you money? We'll come back to that later, but that's number one. You need to look at all your numbers first. Number two is staff. And I'll start with the bottom part first. Do they work for you or do you work for them? And that's a, I'm sure some people are probably laughing right now, but it's, it's actually the truth. There are people in this webinar that you work for your staff. You do. Even though you pay them through a paycheck, you're working for them. And what I mean by it is because if you don't have the expenses calculated and you don't know what everything's costing, basically like, you know, you're, you're, they're not bringing any money in uh, based on the program and you're actually just paying them. I mean, how long do you think a business could, could do that for? How much longer could it do it? If you don't find that out immediately, just, the money's just going down the tubes. So the question is, are they making or losing you money? And that's, this, again, is one of the reasons why we've created Mr. Marketer, is because you know, there's a lot of schools we talk to, uh, people are distracted, they're not doing this, they're not doing that. Uh, so we've just said, wait a second, we know we're going to help with the front desk position to automate it, uh, to make sure that it's being done I mean, you know, the humans, the humans make errors. Uh, this, this, will not, this will go out automatically 24-7, whether someone's sick. They have what I call the, quote, personal issue. I mean, I, I'm, sure, I'm not sure if you guys love that one, but I think that's one of the best ones I've ever heard. The personal issue uh, comes up more and more often. Now, that's like the excuse for when someone wants to say, it's none of your business why I didn't come to work today. You know, uh, it's, I, I just laugh at that one. The personal, well, here's the thing. You get two personal issues when you're going to work with me. After that, then you could take, you, when you get your personal issues fixed, then you can call me back and see if you still have a job. So that's, uh, you know, I might be tough, but that's it. I'm, well, I'm, like I said, I look at it every day I'm going to war. Every day I'm in the jungle. Every day someone's trying to take something from me, and that's the way the business is today. Uh, everyone's trying to get those students in the door for the martial arts school. Everyone's, you know, trying their best. You can't have people that are having these, these issues all the time. Step number three is, are you building a database 24-7? It's not you know, for a birthday party. That's not when you're, when you're trying to build a database. You should be building a database, emails, text messaging, social, all that stuff, 24-7, okay, 365. If you're not, then that's the one thing we've got to start doing immediately. Step number four, do your classes rock? You know, are they awesome? Are they amazing? 
You know, like I know some amazing instructors. Uh, if you'd like to see some of them, uh, you know, I, I could definitely give you some names. Their classes are amazing. They're ridiculous. I love them. Uh, I get, I, I watch them. I'm like, I want to jump in that kid's class. I'm like, this, this guy's got me motivated. He's got everybody clapping. Uh, he's got everybody, you know, pumped up. All right. Uh, you know, who told you that your classes are awesome? Is it just yourself telling you that? You know, like let someone else look at your classes. Uh, do you read? Are you a coach or a dictator? So a, a great coach, black belt instructor, is basically coaching, uh, you know, and telling and motivating, inspiring, educating, which you see I've done here at the bottom. Or there's the dictator who's just standing there and saying, okay, 20 this, 20 that, go, 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 and you're not educating. You know, if you, if you, have, if you don't have a lot of students, th these are some of probably the main reasons why. It's not because of your website. It's not because of Google AdWords. It's not because of your SEO. It's because you need to take a look at your classes. Uh, and here's the thing I always tell everybody, too. When people, have, people ask me this, they say, so how do you get referrals? Like, how, what's the best way to ask students for referrals? Well, let's stop right there. That is probably the worst thing you can say to someone is, like, so like what, is the, how, what is the best way to ask for referrals? If you would ask for referrals, then whatever you're doing is not working. That's, that's it. Like, if, you, if I had to go up to a student and say, hey, Bill, listen, do um, you have any referrals you can give me? Or if I had to send them an, an email or something like that, you know, that, that means that your classes are not as good as you think they are, that your establishment is not as good as you think it is. If you'd like to send me a video of your classes, um, I could definitely, I would love to take a look at it and show some of my uh, friends and other people that I work with that are amazing instructors. I've been very fortunate to work with some of the best instructors. Uh, I'll, I'll give some shout-outs right now. Dennis Liebert, I don't know if he's in the house. All right, Sensei Dennis, one of the best Tigers and Dragons instructors I've ever seen. Uh, Chris Malera's, uh, just energy-wise. Preston Conyers, uh, Mike Baca, Mark Russo. Uh, these were some of the best instructors I saw coming up. I mean, they weren't as good as me, but they were pretty good. These guys were actually, I'm just kidding. They were, they, those guys were amazing. And uh, if you're up on the East Coast and you want to come visit some of those guys, um, you know, great classes. Master Freed is a great instructor as well. Uh, I, I love his style. Like you know, um, he almost killed me once when I was in his one of his black belt tests. But uh, just he, he knows how to push you to the limit. That's for sure. Uh, so those are some of the great instructors I've seen. Step number five. This is very important. You really need to take notes on this one. Understanding understand fixed marketing costs. So these are the things that you have to pay for 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 marketing, whether it's with us or it's somebody else or anybody. But if you start taking away some of these. Uh, then you're gonna. That's why you're gonna be stressed out. And if you have no money to do them, then there's not much you could do. Uh, SEO, you're just getting your site indexed and found on Google. Obviously, that's important. PPC, uh, you know, that's another way to just get your your site up on the top of the search engines. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. You know, but at least you're you're branding yourself and you're getting out there. Um, even if you don't, even if your budget's a hundred bucks a month. I mean, these are all the different things. Having a website. You know, um, I tell everybody when I hear someone say now. Um, you know, well, I'm getting my instructors, my, one of my instructor's friends to do my website or whatever. Like, you know, I, I, I don't have the time anymore to tell people that's going to be the biggest mistake ever make. Um, you know, and, people, and, and what they do is they'll say, well, those websites are templated or it's a template or whatever. Like, the thing is they work and, you know, they're designed a specific way. And, you know, if, if you start having a website with this guy, email marketing with someone else, this text message over here, this software program, constant content, all these different things, they all work together. That's one of the biggest things that I love about what we offer is that everything is in one place. Mobile website. If you don't have a mobile site, you should. Ebooks, uh, content marketing, uh, sales copy, having the right content that will convert people. I spent a lot of time on this in the past year, uh, and more time than I ever thought it would be necessary. But ebooks uh, produced on a consistent basis. What will happen is, in most cases, you know, you'll write it. Uh, maybe you'll do two or three, and then next month is done. That's what that'll that's what's what it will happen with eBooks. Sales copy. If you're not familiar with sales copy, it's copy that should be on uh, you know certain emails, websites, landing pages that is written professionally. Not you know that you didn't go to school for it. I see people calling my designer, uh, you know, asking for custom pages that are just, in my opinion, horrendous. Uh, you know, there's just the whole marketing concept. It's just, you know, you really got to think more like a professional and, and, and try to get a professional and make your stuff. Some of these things that I see from people, I just, I said, that's what they want to do it. I said, but it just looks horrible. And, you know, you want to make sure it's written a specific way. That's what sales copy is. Software, whether you're using us or not. Uh, Mr. Marketer is a marketing software. There's a lot of things you don't know about yet that we're going to go over that it has the capabilities of doing that are going to help you. And I'll talk about that later. Blogging, um, you know, if you're blogging, 
Uh, it's one of the greatest ways to get traffic to your website if you do it consistently. So the, the, in my opinion, these things all need to be done okay, um, for, to, in order for marketing. And if you start asking yourself, I don't, I don't do SEO, I don't do no PPC, I have a website, I have a mobile website, that's good, I have no ebooks. I have no sales copy, I have no software, I have no marketing software, and I'm not blogging. Okay, well then, that's going to be one of the reasons why you're in this situation. So, now that we talked about that, let's get what everybody's here for. Um, and, you know, most of our webinars, the Master Free, myself, we, we, we really try to give you a lot of information to help you, help you with marketing, retention, and this here, we're going to go right into it. Like, what is Mr. Marketer? How does it work? So it's Mr. Marketer. This is like an overview first, and I'm going to go over into more detail. Mr. Marketer is a hired expert to grow your business. All right? It's not me. I'm not, it's not just me doing your work. We have a, a professional team, okay, doing everything for us. Uh, we're, uh, everything that we're making, it's professionals. It's not Nick making an e-book. Okay, I'm not a writer. I, 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 can I write an e-book? Probably. You know, can you? I'm sure you can too. But they should be written a certain way, and that's what you're. That's what you're, this is like an outsourced marketing company that you're getting for a very, very affordable price, which we'll go into later. Uh, digital signature is one of the core things that you know that I'm using now in my school, um, and with Mr. Marketer, it's made it a lot easier. I've been beta testing it, using a lot of emails. People are coming in. We're using this now. Really cool feature. I just wanted to highlight that and show that it's very cool. Digital signature for waivers, contracts, and documents. Uh, Mr. Marker contains hundreds of emails and landing pages already done for you. Landing pages, emails. Uh, we also do two daily engaging social posts. This is what you're going to start seeing in January, if you notice here. Uh, things for the holidays for jiu-jitsu, e-books, uh, different images like that. And then we also do engagement posts, humor, okay, and then we also do motivational posts. And, you know, I, I, sometimes I, I just laugh because some people – you know, they, they don't understand. Like, you know, you've got to mix it up. You have to mix it up on social media. So now we're trying to have subscription-based emails or uh, templates or images, like benefits of BJJ, e-books, and this is connected to a link in Perfect Mind. So you'll know at the end of the month how many people downloaded the e-book. You'll know every day as soon as they download it, but then the month you go back and see how many people actually downloaded this, how many people were interested in jiu-jitsu. So we're mixing content, you know, that's, you know, for – People to sign up, also educating your students, okay, at the same time. That's going out twice a day and only once on Saturday and Sunday, and we only post to Facebook because that's where you're going to get the best results. Uh, hundreds of marketing material and e-books, we have all of them in there, and we consistently keep making five to six new e-books a month, which I'll get to. Mr. Marketer consists of lead nurturing, student automation, and former student nurturing. So lean nurturing, student automation, which in my opinion is the biggest key to Mr. Marketer, and then former student nurturing. That's what Mr. Marketer consists of. Mr. Marketer also contains referral and rewards programs that are automated for you. It can also includes marketing analytics and notifications. It also includes a customized mobile website that's connected to Perfect Mind. How much does Mr. Marketer cost? Now, this is what I'm what I'm talking about here is. This is what it would cost you to make the, the same stuff that we already have ready. All right, you might think that, it's, that I'm crazy. I'd like to add another 10 to that number, another 10 grand. Professional written content, if you have 100 pieces, okay, $100 a pop, all right, professionally designed pages, all right, that's more than $10,000. A part-time marketing staff, which you're getting, uh, $10 an hour, you know, like whatever you, if you broke it down, whatever, $1,600 to $2,000 a month. Marketing automation software. You're getting the software that's included with it. You're looking at close to twenty to thirty thousand dollars. That's what it would cost you to make the same thing. And here's the thing: imagine me with a team of almost 115 people total. All right, taking six months to build Mr. Marketer. By the time you do it, okay, so we're looking. It's already 2014 uh, at least. Now the ongoing cost you're looking at approximately two thousand two hundred fifty dollars a month. That's what it would cost you every month to make the same material to get everything done. So let's take, a little, let's take a little closer about Mr. Marker. I'm going to show you now what I'm talking about. The first thing is the eBook Center. The eBook Center is an application that goes on your website. Now, if your website's not with us, you can have a link to the eBook Center. So the eBook Center, benefits of yoga, bully prevention kits, how to set goals with your children, why martial arts is beneficial, six benefits of BJJ, five benefits of kickboxing, confidence kit, Krav Maga, all these different eBooks are already done for you. They're already made on your website. And then what we do now is we automate emails to your leads that will drive them to the ebook center. And you also should be nurturing your students because everything on here is professionally written. 
And you want them to read it as too because that's also nurturing them, ex explaining to them why they're paying you $249 a month to be a student or whatever, $199 a month, whatever they pay you. This is another thing that's explained to them why. All right, so there, and then we have more things coming down the road for this, but this is the first application we have, which is known as the eBook Center. So Drive leads the eBook Center. What is the free book center? Here's the email that goes out to them. And then it links them to that. They take it. They could download any one of them. And whenever they would actually you know, uh, uh, download one, you would know who it was, whether it's a student or a lead, you know. So if it's a lead, then you would get a lead notification. And then you can call them a day later. And you could say to them, now think about how much easier it is from a psychological standpoint. If I am talking to a person that downloaded an ebook on confidence, and I know that they're not a student, now basically let's do a little quick role play right now. Hi, Mr. Johnson. Uh, this is Nick calling from Champions Way, or Champions. Hey, Nick, how are you? Oh, great. Listen, uh, I, I, know that, I noticed that you downloaded our ebook on confidence. Uh, I'm assuming it was for your, you know, your son because you put a, some information in there, and um, I just want to see what you thought about it. They would say it was great. And then from there, now all of a sudden, you're, you know, these are the things we teach here. So what do you think about it? You know, and basically, you know, that, that, that's how it will work. That you would drive people there to the eBooks, and these things work as not only retention tools but also lead tools. So keep that in mind. All right, let's move on from here. Okay, and if anybody has any questions, um, you know, make sure that, that we would like you to post on our Champions Way Facebook page if you have any questions at all and any feedback about the webinar. Please visit our Champions Way Facebook page. Here's what it looks like when you actually go to the bully prevention. See how it's professionally written. Okay, and then this is the form, and that's what, you know, that, that once they fill it out, you would get a notification. Here's an example of, I only put one page on here of the benefits of Muay Thai. All right, so you can check that out. Uh, you know, this is an example of one of the e-books. We do four to five new e-books per month, life skills, martial arts, tips, educational, and all done by professional writers. Okay, there will be no misspelling. There will be nothing. There will be no errors in here at all. Everything's professionally done. And some people have asked, you know, about if they want to change the content. No, you don't want to change the content. It's written perfectly. Keep it. Uh, you don't need to change anything um, and because it's going to keep coming. And you want to keep producing and getting it out there and getting more content out there. Um, this is another part of Mr. Marketer that's really cool, the incoming sales funnel. So Mr. Marketer, you get the website, and we, we talked about the social media posts that we do for you. Uh, also, the email marketing, which we're going to show you some samples. <laughs> but I want to go over next the Mr. Marketer opt-in forms because you got to you have to make sure you're getting people to go to directly into Perfect Mind. So we have three opt-in forms for you for your school. The first one is for events. Okay, we'd like to thank you for participa participating in our event. So when you go to let's say a kidnapping prevention, uh, I'm sorry, let's say you go to a Fourth of July parade or you're going to a summer parade or anywhere in summer, you're doing a demo at the movie theater, wherever you're doing. All right, instead of having tablets or people sign in. You should just take your iPad, your iPhone, doesn't matter, take the link, and they can fill that out, and then it goes right into Perfect Mind. For, and then we even have there a, a field that would say what type of event it is, and then from there, we can even set up autoresponders that would explain if it was a bully prevention seminar, a free bully prevention, excuse me, kit would be emailed to them. Okay? Thank you for checking us out. This is for walk-ins. So I have a walk-in that I can't book, and it gets put on a sticky tab. Uh, that that lead is down the tubes. Okay, uh, it's just it's on it's on your sticky tab. It's in the trash. Never gets called again. Don't even bother with wasting your time with that. Just have them fill out this on an iPad, a tablet, whatever. I'm an iPhone guy, so I keep saying iPad it goes right into Perfect Mind. And then the most important one is the birthday parties. These are these come with you for Mr. Marketer. We'll be making more of them. And the best part is they're responsive. They work on the iPhone. Uh, they work on the iPad. They work uh, on a computer. If you have a big laptop, you're, you still haven't gotten. Um, the tools, you know, like that. Yeah, you could use a laptop, and they could fill this out. It goes right into Perfect Mind, and then your leads could be automatically, you know, going through the, our nurturing system. Uh, lead automation. We have automated uh, emails that are again written by professionals uh, for every style. Uh, you know, everything from BJJ, no gi BJJ. We have boxing. Uh, we're producing everything. They're all done for you, and we're making new ones every single month. That's also the coolest thing about Mr. Marketer. You don't just it's just every month we make a new release. Uh, with new content, new things, new tools. So that's one of the things that's really cool. Um, quick start online memberships. So if you're offering jiu-jitsu, Muay Thai, kickboxing, whatever you're offering, uh, we will drive the, the leads in your email system to a buy now page that's responsive that will offer your quick start membership. So it could be six weeks for, four weeks for 69. It could be six weeks for 69. You could change those two. You could change the price and the name. 
I'm sorry, the price and the weeks that you're offering that pro that that uh, special. And we have we have we have these buy now pages for every program. That's part of the QuickStart Online membership. Sales copy ebooks. I'm, I have to take a second to show you. Uh, sales copy ebooks. These are done for you. Here's one for for example. Uh, this is for Nogi BJJ, and the, the image in there would change. That's just I just put that in there for one of our new uh, clients. And this would be this is known as long sales copy, and this is an ebook that somebody would get when they're inquiring about information for you know Nogi BJJ. All right, and th there's we have this for every style. Okay, professionally written. Okay, and you, these ebooks come along with you know when someone's inquiring about a program. Uh, we have short ones as well. Uh, this is for jujitsu. All right, everything's again professionally written. Uh, this this stuff takes literally 16 hours to make. Kickboxing. Okay, if, if you could see that, great. If not, uh, I can show you later. Uh, here's one for just martial arts for children for the holidays. You know, it's all it's all professionally written. So these are ebooks that they would get that would also overcome pretty much every objection that a person would have. Uh, this, one of my favorite ones is this. <coughs> excuse me, is one of the um, one I made for Ace Ramirez. This is one a general one for Muay Thai, and then this is one I made for Master Ace. Shout out to Master Ace. I forgot about you. I hope you're here, but I hope you're here, brother. So here's one for uh, Muay Thai, really nice uh, for Muay Thai kickboxing, and this is professional sales copy written by professionals. And from there, they would be able to read that, and then they would get linked to uh, the, the online memberships. Okay, let's get back to the slide. I just I couldn't take screenshots of that, so I had to do it that way. Um, we have it for children's martial arts. We, we're going to have them for everyone, every style. Krav Maga. All right, so this is the one I wanted to talk to you about, Mr. Marketer software. So Mr. Marketer comes with um, a, 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 the software, <clears throat> Mr. Marketer, where we have lead stages. So your leads will automatically be qualified into what's known as a marketing qualified lead, a sales op a qualified lead, and an opportunity qualified lead. And the content that we have going to them is based on, like, for example, a, a marketing lead is a person that's been in your database for 10 years, and they've never come in for an introductory lesson or filled out a form in the past you know, 90 days. Um, a sales opportunity is a person that filled out a form, but you were unable to convert. An opportunity is a person that filled out a form and is now in a trial program. So we don't want to send someone who's, a, who's an opportunity lead things about signing up on the six-week special or whatever your quick start program is. That's one of the most important aspects of it. Now, we also have lead profiles. Uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff, but this is one of the most important things. Lead staging is set up in Mr. Marketer for you. Student, uh, student automation, we start promoting summer camp for you January 1st or 2nd, I believe it is. And this is an uh, example of one of our email templates. Everything is coded. Uh, everything where you see there's a button right here will be linked to a landing page for summer camp. So this is one about summer camp. Um, and your logo will be in here at the bottom. All of your information will be in there. We have a thing called Elements. That's how easy the setup process is. I go through Elements with you to explain you how they work. And then Mr. Marker is installed, and then you're, you're good to go. So this is an example of a summer camp. We have a birthday party drip system to former uh, students, leads, and students. And these are some examples of you know no stress, no mess, ideal birthday party for both parents and kids connected to a birthday party landing page. Uh, we even have birthday party ebooks that people for people. That's an example of one of the landing pages on the left. Opt in uh, the form, some testimonials talking about the birthday parties, surveys for leads and students. One of my favorites. Okay, this is awesome. I love this. So for students, you could actually, uh, we set out an automatic survey based on their second week, fourth week, sixth week, first class, first lesson, birthday party. If there's a, someone has a birthday party, we have an automatic survey. When someone cancels their program, lead second week, winter, fall, spring, summer, all automatic surveys all go into Perfect Mind, and you get the actual data that goes along with it. Here's an example of a birthday party survey. So someone just had a birthday party. If you're using our calendar in Perfect Mind and you click Completed, the next day, it sends them an automatic survey about how they enjoyed it. Now, in these surveys, this is where we're also asking for if they refer somebody. We're asking for referrals for you. And then you get all the data to this into your Perfect Mind account. So this is all automated. Every single one you're looking at right here, they go out automatically. And if you want to send them out on your own, you can do that as well. Okay? So there's an example of a birthday party survey. Social media contests, one thing we've done is we know that Basically, most people will just not promote their social media as much as they should. So we drive social uh, reach automatically three times a year. We have a couple Facebook uh, uh, review contests, 
And we have another one where they ask their friends. We have a code that we give you with instructions on how to increase your Facebook likes on your fan page. Uh, we also have a hashtag contest. So these are some of the examples of, like, the, you know, once we determine your hashtag, here's an example of the Facebook Review Rewards Program, and these are connected to landing pages. So if people do not want to participate, then they want to participate. If they want to participate, they'll click the landing page, and you'll know who they are. And then you tell them to see the front counter, and that's when you can get in the, a nice PDF we made for you. <coughs> or you can put it in a Word document and change it. Remind students uh, to follow up with your, uh, your follow your brand. We do that as well. Here's an example of a follow us email template to like you on Facebook. This go out to your students uh, all the time as well. Okay, that's another example. Here's those other Facebook. Re we do one in the summertime. We try to expand your social reach with a, a summer rewards program for Facebook. Uh, that's what an example that looks like. One of the other favorite ones we have for automation is what we call landmark automation. Landmark automations are emails that go out to your students when they've been a student for a year, two years, three years, up to 10 years. And then it would say, you know, thank you, congratulations, blah, blah, blah. And then you could decide the gift that you give them. And that is how you build loyalty. That is how you build a, a great customer service. All these things we're doing, where we're trying to reward the students besides the leads, this is a really big thing that will help you and people will really appreciate it. You could just change that image in the element section. So if you want to give a Starbucks gift card, you want to give karate cash, whatever it is you want to give away, you could change that. Community automated email marketing. I, I, saw, I had an interesting email earlier today. It was interesting. Someone uh, doesn't like the free kidnapping prevention. And I thought that was interesting because, you know, like these are the seminars that you have to do. It's just you have to. Uh, these are the community events. The women's self-defense, you know, we, we want to spread the name and let people know about your kids' programs and get women in the door. Kidnapping prevention, you know, there's a lot of kids getting abducted, and uh, if you don't know how to do them, I have the content to teach you how to do them. It's included in Mr. Marketer. And bully prevention seminars, which the entire world is doing. So if you think that you don't need these or you shouldn't be doing these, these go out automatically. And what we're trying to do is book you. We get, they're connected to landing pages where people can book themselves for bully prevention, uh, kidnapping prevention, women's self-defense. Okay, they're able to book themselves for these things. One of the newest, uh, one of the other best features I love in Mr. Marketer are video landing pages and email message for emails you will need. So these are landing pages that will be connected to an email, and some of the ones we have are where have you been, congrats on the new belt, thanks for the referral, Facebook contest, summer camp, quick start, weekly announcement. And these are, so it's, it's an email that actually goes out, video message. You want to send someone a video message on thanks for the referral? These are templates, okay? There are, there are hundreds of templates in there. So we even made ones for videos. You don't need to have, know how to do any code. You make the video. You put the YouTube link in the element section when I set you up for the training, and that's it. It gets connected to the page. So not only do we have things that are automated, but we also have ones that are template-based, like demo teams, uh, things like, you know, like that. We have that as well. All right. Uh, custom Mr. Marketer reports and notifications. Uh, everything that is tracked in Mr. Marketer from lead and, the, and student automation, uh, you'll get a report on it. Even social posts are tracked to see how many people subscribe to it. And even your survey results are broken down for you. So if you want to see your first class feedback every time when someone does a first class, two, four, six, birthday, exit, any of these, they're all broken down for you in the custom reports. All right, guys. Well, I went over a lot. I don't want to take up too much of your time. I know that everybody's been in a lot of webinars today. Okay, so basically um, I want to show you a quick video and tell you about today's uh, offer for Mr. Marketer. Uh, so if you'd like to hire Mr. Marketer today, it's $400 a month. It includes the website, it includes the mobile website, it includes the software, everything and all the content. All right, so that's what the price is of Mr. Marketer. Okay, you have to have the software, you can't not have perfect mind. Now, if you don't want to have your website with us, that's okay. We can work off of another website. We would use the forms and then everything, everything would be filtered into perfect mind. Well, so and, and we really appreciate the feedback, anybody that's going on Facebook and let us know about Mr. Marketer. We know that we have a revolutionary, a revolutionary product. Uh, we know it's going to save you time. We know it's going to help you, save you money. And we're looking forward to working with everybody. So uh, take advantage of that special. Uh, and I'll now answer some questions if anybody has any. And on behalf of Champions Way, guys, uh, this is Seth Nick. Thank you so much. Well, now I'm going to do a Q&A. Okay, first series of questions. Can you choose which e-books are shown? Some are some. Our, our competition and not what we offer. Okay, yes, great question. So let's go over that. During the interview process, we actually go through what eBooks they're shown. Yes, so we're not just going to throw them up there. So we just ask you which ones you would like, which ones you would not like, 
And then if we don't have something that you're looking for, I try my best to make sure that if it's something I believe other schools could benefit from, we will make it. Uh, another question would be here, uh, can I control what eBooks my contact, my contact have access to? As a TKD guy, I love BJJ and Krav Maga, but I don't want to promote it to prospects. Again, that's a very similar question. And yes, they will not, like, we, we will go through the eBooks in the setup call. So if, you don't, if there's any eBooks that you do not want, you will not have to worry about that. They will not be shown to your prospects. So the, there is a, a, a part of the setup where we go through and we, we, we review that with you. So you won't have to worry about eBooks that you don't want to be given away. Uh, would you please list the eBook you recommended here? Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, the book, yes, it was Customer Satisfaction is Worthless, Customer Loyalty is Priceless, Jeffrey Gittimer. And Master Ace, hey, how are you, sir? Glad you're here. When will the eBooks be available? Uh, when you install Mr. Marketer, that's when they are available, as soon as we install Mr. Marketer into your account. Uh, does that include SEO? Uh, no, we do not include SEO in Mr. Marketer. SEO is not included. If you like additional information about programs that include, uh, in addition, uh, other services, SEO, things like that, make sure you absolutely uh, contact uh, the sales team at 877-774-5425, extension 1. And if you, heat, if you could put that number in the box, that would be great. Question, if you already have website SMO with Purple Mind, what is the difference? Uh, the difference is, Shane, is that basically you will now get all the Mr. Marketer at no additional cost. So you're, you're a grandfathered in. If you, quit, if you quit SMO five months ago, two months ago, and you decided to come on back, uh, there's nothing I could do for you. But if you are a current SMO client, you will be getting in contact with me probably in the beginning of the new year. Uh, so we have some beta testers getting on it as well. Uh, like, but other than that, I will be in contact with you shortly. Uh, what will be automated when it kicks off? Uh, Leroy, uh, pretty much uh, all the lead automation and all the student automation, uh, will be, all that, everything I've, I've shown will be automated, except for the ones that you, we talked about in your interview that we did together. Like if you don't offer summer camp, if you don't offer things like that, they will not be automated. What if you're already a Champions Way customer? What is the cost? Uh, Darren, the best bet would be uh, to actually contact the sales team. Uh, I'm not sure what you're currently paying, so that be, they'd be the best people to... Uh, to answer that question for you. Will current SMO clients get an updated website? Uh, not really, uh, Anthony, unless you, it's been like a, you have to talk to NEMA about that, because really Mr. Marketer is, you know, you get a website with it, but we're not, you know, there really won't be much you need to do. So if you need a website update, I would definitely email uh, NEMA to see if you qualify for that. Uh, if our system is one of our templates, would you work with us to create it? If our system isn't one of your templates, would you work with us to create it? Um, yes, uh, I would just need to know who that is. I could probably answer that question a little bit better, or you can call the sales team. How does this fit in with Perfect Mind? Are you asking for 400 hours on top of the fee we're already paying if we're on SMO? No. If you are, again, um, um, if there's any questions, if you're SMO, there's no additional cost for you. Okay. <laughs> Does that price include Perfect Mind or is it on top of what we pay for a Perfect Mind? If you have Perfect Mind, okay, guys, the best bet would be, you know, I'm not sure if you have a website, what you're paying for, uh, just contact Vahid, contact the sales team. I'm sure the numbers and the phones are going off the hook, and they will take care of you. It's four hours including Perfect Mind. So uh, make sure you talk to them about that. And someone has asked, I received an email that it was free to anyone who had the SMO package. Is that still true? Yes. No, you know what? No, it's not going to be true any longer. Uh, we're going to have to raise no, I'm just kidding. Yes, it is true. The e-books will not be in your doc center until we install Mr. Marketer. And we are in the process of you know, get, getting that organized in the next 24 hours. Uh, that's what we're working on. So, like, I've, and, uh, guys, I really appreciate it, and uh, the feedback has been amazing. Um, and if I have not been in contact with you, if you're an SMO client, um, when I get in contact with you in the next five, three to four days, that's when you will get it. So, I mean, um, I just, if I really would appreciate if, um, if you could just, you know, let me get back to you and let you know. Uh, that way we can get you interested or get you on. They will only market to Facebook, no longer Twitter, Google Plus, and Pinterest etched. Uh, we never marketed to Pinterest, uh, and we will no longer be posting to Twitter or Google Plus. That's correct. So if I was at an event, I had people that could sign in on my tablet. If it goes to Perfect Mind, will it automatically start sending emails to those leads? Yes. 
Are you doing any postings on Facebook or just supply the assets? We are posting twice a day on Facebook. Will you have any Olympic TKD material for my competitive or Olympic games? Uh, yes. Now, I would need to talk to you in more detail. Um, so we will be making more content for other styles. Uh, I just want to, we, the best thing we would do, would do to actually, you know, uh, just send me an email, um, and we can talk in more detail to sensei.nick at championsway.com. Uh, if you're SMO, you don't need an interview, guys. Um, I'll say that one more time. If you are SMO, I do not need an interview from you at all right now. I don't need anything. So just I'm just trying to get uh, get organized with the Heat and my team. We'll be in contact with you, and that's it. Uh, what about content in article marketing? Are you rehashing content, or is it original content? Uh, the ebooks are not they're not uh, they're, they're they're hidden. So when it comes to ebooks, Roberto, uh, they have to download them. There's, they're not public on your website. So make sure you're aware of that. In regards to sales copy. There is actually a content that's put in there specifically for your page and for your area. So the rest of the content is images, which is not indexed unless we put a, some type of a HTML tag on there. All right, this is it. I'm going to have to stop it here at this point. Let me see here. Uh, can, I have a, can I get up your email and get the three things to raise prices? Yes, sensei.nick at championsway.com. Uh, can I have an email to get the three things to raise prices? Yes, another one. Anyone that needs anyone is the same one. Anyone needs help with that? Um, it does not take a, any type of training whatsoever. Um, so anyone that needs anything at all, sensei.nick at championsway.com. So of that wheel of the services, which ones do you provide? We provide all of them except for PPC. Last questions. Why is it that a 16-year-old can't be a leadership member? Why is it a 16-year-old can't be a leadership member? Uh, ask twice. Uh, a 16-year-old absolutely can be a leadership member in your school, um, not in my school. Uh, as far as I'm talking about teaching adults or students leadership, that's, I mean, listen, you can do anything you want in your school. I'm explaining in my school, um, and I do not want, you know, like a, a child, okay, or a teenager talking to my, my parents about becoming a leader or about becoming giving me advice on leadership. Like they could be a leadership member, but you know, they could talk about it, but I'm talking about, in my opinion, you know, when you have kids teaching classes and they're, they're up there talking about these things, if I was a parent, I would be going to the head instructor saying, listen, this is great, but when are you going to teach the classes? That's the only point I'm trying to make. I'm not saying that they can't be a leadership member. I'm saying that you know, I think that adults are leaders. I think that adults have been through things. I'm not saying that they can't teach. I'm saying that if you have kids running your classes all the time, all the time, you're going to lose students. If you don't believe me, then um, that's just my opinion. You don't have to agree with it. I'm very excited. I look forward to grow the next level. Awesome. Um, we don't. We never post it to Google Plus, uh, sir. Ever. I'm sorry to Pinterest. So not sure. Uh, if a, a, any more questions, you could uh, email marketing at championsway.com. That is it for today, guys. Uh, that is it. All right. So that is all we have for today. I'd like to thank everybody for attending. And uh, thank, special thanks to Vahid, to Nicole, to Mahan, to Pedram, to Eric, to everybody involved in Mr. Marketer. On behalf of uh, Champions Way, this is Sensei Nick. I will be here for another couple minutes. Um, but other than that, thank you so much, and we look forward to working with you. Take care, everybody.